Hello everyone and welcome back to the series of MATLAB and Simlink tutorial. Today we will study the effect of non-linearities such as saturation, dead zone and backlash on the DC motor, where the link of the detailed lecture is given in the description. Now we will open the MATLAB and then Simlink library and will add the required blocks such as step input, saturation, dead zone, backlash, a transfer function, vector concatenate and the scope. Now I have already added the blocks and arranged them. Now we will simulate the simulation and will analyze the effect of nonlinearities one by one. Starting with saturation, if you open the scope, the yellow line represents output for first case, where the pink line represents output for second one. You will find a difference of 5 volt between both cases because the saturation block have limit of minus 5 to plus 5 volt which means that if input exceeds the 5 volt, it will be saturated. Now we will open the scope 1 and will analyze the effect of dead zone, where the dead zone limits are from minus 2 volt to plus 2 volt, which means that output greater than plus 2 volt will be applied to the DC motor. And here again the both responses will have a difference of plus 2 volts. Now we will analyze the backlash and here in this case we are analyzing the angular position so for this we have added an integrator where the dead band have a width of 1 which means that the width of 0.5 will be used for both direction now if you open the scope 2 you will find that the system with backlash changes its direction after every 0.5 second whenever the system without backlash changes its direction Thanks for watching the video. This was all about today and stay connected for more updates.